Hello and welcome back to another episode of Seiko Modder. Before we get started, make sure you give me that thumbs up to help with the YouTube algorithm. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel on the bottom right hand corner and we'll get started on this mod right here in just a moment. So for this episode of uh, Seiko Modder, this right here is going to be a modified um, Aquanaut. This is a very well beautiful executed murdered out version so it's just all black on black. The uh, case diameter on this is going to be 40 millimeters with the uh, lugs on the bottom here at 20 millimeters. So it's going to be an excellent candidate for just uh, you know changing out straps if you don't like this uh, silicone textured band that I have it built on. Uh, case diameter for this is a little bit over 13 millimeters, so certainly not too thick. It's a really good good size. If you look at the dial on it, it's a very nice um, squared off texture. This uses the NH35 automatic movement, so again very very well executed. Right here on the crown, give me a moment, first position. Whoops. Nice and clicky. The date complication spins nice. Second position, adjust the time. And of course when you're done make sure you push it in. Flipping this around, again this is the NH35 automatic movement, so it's like the uh, the Honda Civic engine if you will. It's a uh, very reliable and easy to service. This right here is going to be a butterfly clasp. Give it a push or a squeeze right here. Pass right open. I'm going to put on my wrist. I have a 19 millimeter wrist. Let me go up like this. 19 millimeter wrist. So that's about a 7.25 inches. I think it fits great. If you like this piece, email me. I'm going to zoom in right here so you can take a look, go a little slower. Again, very, very well executed piece. Don't forget to give me that thumbs up to help the YouTube algorithm. Subscribe to the channel on the bottom right hand corner. And I will see you on the next one. Thank you.